welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm gonna be showing you how i put my own wig on that is why i'm looking like this i already got the cap on because i'm gonna be doing the ball cap method and it's squeezing the heck out of my forehead right now the installing is this one right here i will link all of the info about this wig down below so if you want to go purchase this unit or you just want to know where I got it from, it will be in the description box, so make sure that you check that. But yeah, enough of me talking, let's get right into it. So basically what I'm doing is taking the got to be glue and I'm spraying it all over my hairline so that the surface will just look flatter and like more like it's coming straight from your scalp. So next what I'm doing is taking my blow dryer and I'm just making sure that the glue is dried. Um, and don't be like me and burn yourself. Use it at like the low heat setting. I was rushing, so I had it on high. So in some of the clips, you can kind of tell that like it was burning the heck out of me. So next, I'm just taking some powdered foundation and I'm applying it to the cap. Um, whatever shade works for you. Mine's, I can't remember the exact shade that I use, but I'll try to link it down below if I do think of it or do I, if I remember to put it in there but yeah you just apply it all over and next what I'm about to do is go ahead and cut the little holes where my ears are gonna be because you don't want to leave that on that's like that defeats the whole purpose of the ball cap method if you just don't cut the holes in there so yeah that's what I'm doing now and then the next step is going to be me just cutting like around cutting the excess lace around the hairline off. So like I was saying in the last clip, now I'm just cutting the excess lace from the front. Um, and make sure that you're careful because you can like easily cut your forehead. And also make sure that you cut like enough of the lace off. You want it to like mimic how your hairline is. So you don't want to leave too much lace. You don't want to... Um, cut it too far back where it's not gonna lay down so just be careful when you're doing that so right now all I'm doing is taking the gel and I'm like pressing it down so that the pieces of the cap aren't like rolling back so you see how that side is flat and the other side wasn't you want both sides to be flat just like the first side so sometimes you have to like cut off some more of the lace sometimes you have to like press it down some more but yeah, that's pretty much all that this step is, just making sure that you press it down. And also just try to get it like to lay as flat as possible and look as close to like your scalp as possible. All I'm doing right now is getting ready to cut the ear tabs. So I watched someone's video and the easiest way um, you could really do it is like, part at the tip of your ear and then like cut off all of the excess lace and hair that's in that area so that's what i'm doing right now <laughs> So right now what I'm doing is taking the glue and I'm applying it to my forehead so that I can lay the wig down. So you don't have to worry. None of the um, glue is going to be on your hairline. Um, none of your hair is going to be taken out in this process because most of the glue is going to be on your forehead or on the bald cap. And then I'm going to go ahead and blow dry that so that I can go ahead and lay the lace down and then once I'm done I'm going to tie a scarf around it so it can all kind of like set. So now all I'm doing is going ahead and cutting off the excess lace because you don't want to like leave that on. If people can see your lace it doesn't look like it's natural and we want our stuff to look as natural as possible. <music> So now y'all I'm just putting some eyeshadow down the middle of the part so it'll look more natural. And then I'm also about to attempt to do some baby hairs. Honestly I'm still trying with baby hairs. I'm not good at them at all. Um, So 
Don't talk about me. I'm trying to learn. But yeah, y'all, that's about it for this video. The hair is really nice. I like it so much. Um, if you like this video, make sure you comment down below. Make sure you like and subscribe as well. And also make sure that you check out some of my other videos. Bye, y'all.